Yeah, he's here. Oh, okay. bro. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, right as I turn on the audio. Nice one, Jack. Anyways, hi, everyone. Uh, welcome to another Golden Sea session. Uh, so... We had uh, quite, quite, quite a lot of things happen in this past week. We ran a, uh, obviously our normal sessions on Sunday, but we had a special one on Tuesday, but it was just a one-on-one -on -one with me and Jack. So let me just give you all the recap on both of those. So the first one had the Dine and Dashers and Team Infinity trying to escape from the rest of, uh, trying to arrest from the, uh, escape from the capital and the uh, laboratory in the northern part of Dorado, and a lot of stuff happened. Firstly, uh, most of the several of them battled a an Archalodon, and as things were getting real dire, Auta's daughters, along with several other Ablins, in an act of desperation and refusal to sit idly by, they all combined their powers to evolve into Hydrapple, and with their assistance, they were able to defeat the Archalodon. While that is uh, happening, the rest of Team Infinity find their way here, along with meeting up with Jack the Delmice, who has been searching for the Dino Dashers for a while now, ever since they all got separated. And then uh, they encounter the uh, what was what was the oh yeah <laughs> the tenth expedition that was the name that was the group's name basically Kumar Salthazar Ness Lily all those others they find all but Salthazar all of them dead L literally dead um, however Roosevelt using his life aura is able to bring them all back to life however he is extremely winded from this this is the first time he's resurrected multiple people all at the same time but they were thankfully able able to evacuate all of them and they found Lily's iron barge that was being kept by the uh, government and are currently making, uh, and then proceeded to make their way to catch up to the rest of Team Infinity and the Dino Dashers. While that's happening, Landorus, who has become a shadow Pokemon, has made their presence. And the, uh, the current poke, uh, the current party fights as, uh, much as they can. Unfortunately, Slim is gravely wounded his Spine literally snaps from Landorus's tail just wrapping around his waist and just But right as that is happening um, The rest of Team Infinity arrive and the Dino Dashers along with uh, Claire Slim and their children evacuate and We end that session with a showdown against Landorus awaiting and so before we get into what happened with um with uh, Jack's session, uh, here's a little out of context image for for the people who didn't watch that stream. <laughs> Behold, paradoxes. The iron, the iron hands is dead too. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> Behold, the paradoxes. Pretty. Yep. All right. A lot of dead Pokemon. Oh uh, so yeah. Confuzzled. Yep. Uh, even though you watched the stream, Jacob. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so. Uh, back to the back to the map. So basically, in this um, in this one-on-one -on -one session <laughs> with Jack, Ostinato's spirit has awoken in a cyberspace dimension. However, he's completely lost all of his memories. He doesn't no know. Memories? It. Yep. No uh, identity. Exactly. He has no recollection of who he is, where he came from, what he's doing here. However, he meets several other Pokemon who also are in the similar situation, and they all have picked new simple names. One one is, was a Makuhita named Hands, another was a Ralts named Valiant, another was a Larvesta named Moth. And so, um, the Tainamo takes the name, uh, tame, bleh, takes the name Athimos. They all, uh, you know, uh, talk, get to know each other a bit, and they do a little bit of battling together, finding some other Pokemon that were trapped in this cyber dimension. However, they had gone insane. Uh, and then 
they decide to try to find a way to escape, especially after Athimos starts having these strange, like, brief glimpses into his, his past memories, which give the rest of the group hope that maybe he could help them uh, escape. And so they eventually tr uh, reach the edge of cyberspace, where they encounter digital recreations of the legendary Pokemon known as the Swords of Justice. They all put up a great fight, and, uh, and they get crit like eight times. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, Jack rolled like three nat twenties in one round, uh, and because of that, he was able to defeat. Uh, they were able to defeat the Swords of Justice, and even when they had turned into cybernetic forms, uh, <clears throat> Iron Justice, Iron. I mean, Iron Crown, Iron Boulder, Iron Leaves. Um, they all were able to escape, unfortunately, with, with only one casualty. Uh, that being yep. hands the Makuhita, and then they recon then they uh, w awake back in the real world with new bodies, um, and they all proceed to break out. And the head design head like robotics engineer Silf, the Porygon Z, um, <clears throat> just gets murked right th right then and there by a, a combined effort by several of these uh, uh, robotic Pokemon. And then they find themselves viewing security footage of events that ha transpired several days prior. So, let me just... Alright, uh, let's cut the music there. So, uh, I just realized I didn't go into full screen. Whoopsie! There we go. <laughs> I was like, something about this feels a bit smaller than it should be. There we go. So... Um, here we are back in the robotics lab and Iron Athimos, you and the others are, you guys have just, you killed Sylph, you defeated all of the other Pokemon here, and as you're just letting his fried and electrocuted corpse just lay down there, or lay there up against a bunch of bash cybernetics, yippee murder, yeah, please, <laughs> oh my god, anyways, uh, Iron Treads is currently going through the through the data files and has found several uh, bits of information. Uh, some <laughs> involving the groups known as the Dine and Dashers, Team Infinity, and even all of you guys, all of you your ex you experiments in your previous lives. Uh, un obviously, except for for you, Iron Athimo, since you weren't supposed to be in the program in the first place, your spirit sort of wandered, um, and. However, you guys find security footage of something that happened several days prior. You see security footage of several Pokemon breaking out of upper parts of the robotics lab and doing battle with others such as a Gigantamax Garbodor, <clears throat> an Archaludon, and finally a Landorus. So, let's rewind along with this security footage. And so... Uh, unfortunately, not everyone in uh, the in Team Infinity could could join us. Uh, that mainly being John and Libby. Uh, so we're just gonna retcon them as their characters are um, a little li little busy. So I... yeah, they're 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 basically uh, assisting in the uh, evacuation. And not by taxes or <laughs> um, bad shuttle services. Pretty much, pretty much. Uh, and then let me oh just. Oh god, there are taxes in Pokemon. Uh, There's a government here. Yeah. Also, let me update Roosevelt's speed since I just noticed you turned it to Mew. And. Yeah, I figured it's before combat. Yeah, that's totally fine. All right, and yeah, then. Would also make sense, I suppose. Let me bring up the turn order. So I'll go that... get my laundry later. Uh-huh, yeah, because we got... Yeah, yeah. Since I'm the first turn, apparently. You also had 30 minutes to do this, Bestie. Yeah, I'm you... I'm sorry, the timer just went off. Skill issue. Sure, <gasps> different time. Uh, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> so, let's... Let's begin. All right, uh, one sec. Copyright strike. Really, for for uh, a a a mediocre. Alistair I make person? a joke. Jokes are supposed to be funny, J Jacob. <laughs> Anyways, Lavender, your turn. I found it funny. All right, first up. Interesting. Hey, the Sea of Star soundtrack. Yes. All right. 
First up, bet just because of the funny. Let's just start that. All right. Why is that? There we go. In case symbiotic anyone. Aura. Yeah. The possessor of the symbiotic aura extends this aura to their symbiont, which is going to be Roosevelt. The two of them are always yeah. aware of each other's locations, health, and mood. They can always communicate telepathically. They may also access each other's moves, features, skills, and edges. Always using the higher of the two skills or stats. The combat stage bonuses of the aura are also applied to both parties. Unlike most auras, this aura cannot be disabled by normal means and requires the slaying of one of the aura to uh, one of the pair to undo it. I will say, uh, Lavender, currently because Roosevelt is in his Mew form, you can only access um, the, yeah. the his Mew his Mew moves. No Fair beak enough, blast! No. no! No! No beak blast! Oh no! <laughs> no beak blast against the fly. Oh, no. <laughs> also, um, is, what's your uh, what's your attack and special attack? My attack Lavenders. is nine. My it's special Lavender. attack is thirty-seven. Wow, it's actually kind of low. Wow. Ugh. Oh, there I you. see. Lavender's a bit more tanky than actually mm. attack. I see. Okay, it's okay. So that's my action. As a bonus action, because I want to try and um. Oh, wait, yeah, no, no, no. Symbi symbiotic order is not a a standard action. That's just passive. Well, yeah, it's a free action, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to... Oh, I thought you said you already used your standard action. I'm like, Ayo? Okay, so let me look at the speed real quick. Damn! Dang, this thing's fast! Mm. Okay. One, two, you three... You and me, stats are good. Uh, just a reminder, this is a large hole, so you have to either float above it or go around it. Don't need to. I just need to be within three meters because I'm going to, as a swift action, activate this. Pressure. Ooh, okay. You can only use that will stuff. Okay, for one full round. Ooh, oh, great. That's awful, considering that bro's got a lot of turns in one round. All right. Uh-huh. And then, yeah, I didn't want you to get those EOT stuff going, so no. No earthquake? That's a swift action, and now for my bonus stuff, uh, for my actual action. Also, just to remind... Um, uh, I had to check to make uh -huh. sure of this, uh -huh. because I wanted to be sure that I couldn't do this against a ground type. And it looks like ground types aren't immune to this. I'm going to use memory wipe as a standard action. Flinched and paralyzed. Oh. <laughs> okay then. So all of his. Uh, okay, then that means. Oh wow. Okay. No doing anything. Uh, no. That just means that. Flinched means the initiative gets decreased a bit by five. And he's. And I had to check chance to, to not move. Sure on top of not being able to do anything oh, other than at will moves. So. Bro is nerfed. Oh my god, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, um. Doesn't it also not remember popping out of the hole? Because that. Okay, no, no. It's not, it's not popping out of the hole, but like. Yeah. Pushing out the, or whatever. Uh, it's an extended action ten, to erase minutes. Ten minutes, okay. Yeah. All right. Extended action is... Is that like a full action? Uh, extended action would be multiple turns. Which I'm not oh. doing. Okay. King Crimson. That would yeah, be very I read funny. the abilities. I knew what to do on that first turn, especially since I was first. <laughs> that would be very And funny. now that that's the end, I'm going to go switch my laundry. <laughs> All right. Uh, it is Irene's turn. All right. So with Irene's prank, the prankster, I can use a status move as a free action. So... As a free action, I'm going to uh, activate. And just a yeah. heads up that the status conditions, such as the toxic confu and confusion from the previous battle, are still up. However, Landorus still has their sandstorm active. Gotcha. In that case, uh, as a free action, Irene's going to use Cotton Guard. Ooh, yeah, Defense. get the get those nat ones out of the way. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Right. Or be like me and be get the Giga Chad uh, roll a t Nat Tony on defense curl. Uh, <laughs> right. yeah. Even defense still, even still, you got three Nat Twenties after that. Yeah, and 
version got one nat 20 as a treat, but then I clicked protect. Uh huh. <laughs> didn't yep. get it anymore. Yep. Yep. All right. Uh, Terry, you're up. Wait, hold on. That was just my free action. Oh, my bad. My bad. Yeah. Sorry. And not yet, as Terry. my actual action, Irene is going to set up Tailwind. Ooh, okay. <laughs> so everyone gets a plus five. So everyone, uh, feel free to. Uh, okay. All right. That's gonna. Oh my god, y'all are just going for he who speed control now. Um... Finally, for once, <laughs> Otto is no longer the slowest. So true, Bester. Alright, and... Okay, there we go. And that means that Lavender is also at a 40. Alright, so... Alright, and then... Hold on, I didn't see how much movement Irene has. Uh, Overland is six, so. Dun, 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 this manure is up into a better point. And here. Alright, now it is Terry's turn. So, uh, did Landorus get any type of status effects? Uh, yes, they are uh, currently still poisoned from Slim and just got paralyzed by Lavender. Okay. <laughs> L Lavender is as oh, he God. was like, concocting a strategy and is already getting absolutely yeah. beat down. Uh, yeah, what and I still got... Players would count as, like, hitting him here? Uh, yes, that would count. Ten. Okay, that's from my location. Bro arrived on scene, looked at his funny, and is now getting destroyed. Yeah. Okay, I need to get closer. Hey, no, he didn't look at his funny. He threatened Ottawa while he was trying to get his wife and daughter out of the situation. To he looked pretty funny uh, to me while doing it. To be fair, he was he was already, like, this is phase two, technically. The incarnate form was him breaking Slim's spine and then uh, attacking a bunch of kids. Bro went for the small fi first. Oh, actually, could you, uh, Ooh. the damage is, that... is incorrect. Oh, what, what's it supposed to be? I didn't change the DB. Oh, okay. So can I reroll damage? Oh, yeah. Is it supposed to be higher or lower? It's supposed to be way higher. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Okay! Oh, god, yeah. Uh-huh. Also, because, for the, um... Since things are getting h harder, I decided to be a little m mean and hide the hit point bars for you guys. Oh, I oh that, that just means I that we're gonna be going even more all out than we were before. That is uh. not a benefit to us. <laughs> uh, all right, Halo? what's up? I just noticed something in my description for Hex. It says, like, Hex is like famous for being stronger if the enemy has a status, uh -huh. right? And for some reason, in the description, it says once a scene now. Did you add that? Um. Oh, wait, wait, I think wait, wait. it was the same on... Yeah. No, no, no. I think that was... was... Okay, yeah. I, re I remember having this discussion, I think, with, um, with, with Jacob. Because the thing is, so... Hex, uh, that, that effect is only applied once a scene. However, at Hex is in every other turn move. Move, uh, it's, like... There's, cause like Slim or um, I know Chef at one point had Venishok. However, Venishok is a scene two move, so like kind of balances it out. And also, this is a this like official stuff. I didn't I didn't like change it of my own volition. So this effect where it becomes stronger is once a scene. Yeah. The move okay. itself. Yeah, I, I it's confusing. And like that's the like, kind of iffy thing I have with frequencies, um, because it, it's it's very like all over the place. But unfortunately, rules are rules. All right, more shadow, you're up. Alrighty, um, I'll not use that one just yet. Instead, I'll go for something pretty standard. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. By the yeah, way, yeah, I can move. Yeah. Oh yeah, by the way, uh, Mars Shadow is being controlled by Jack, Lavender is being controlled by Jacob, and Hydrapple is still being controlled by Glastine. And okay, I'm so I'm just gonna say, punch it. Ooh, oh, oh god, okay. Here we go, uh, <laughs> double damage time. 
Are we still on the second turn? Uh, not. We're still on the first. No, no, no. The this first this is the first turn. This is the first round. All right. So, okay, time to make two coin flips because Landorus is in a uh, uh, unfortunate <laughs> case of parafusion. <laughs> Okay, Paral uh, parafusion, paralyze, yeah, paralysis, paralyze. and confusion. Okay, can I break through the paralysis? Yes! Can I break through the confusion? Yes! Oh! Okay, okay, okay. Like, the, uh... <sighs> Rob, forgive me, but I have to do this. Landris is going to use their healer ability to remove all status conditions. Oh my god. Uh, oh, so that poison and paralysis is all that meant nothing. I got that hex damage. Yes. I also need to take a tick of poison damage here. <laughs> mm. uh, along with that, uh, they're going to te uh, still suppress. Yeah. Oh, I know. I know. I know. Um, and then. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. One sec. One sec. One sec. Let me check something. This is... Repressed is not a status condition. I know. We know. I know. That's why I did... I. Well, I mean, Marsh Shadow's thing is covering it, but yeah, I put an icon for it. It's still there. It's still there. Don't worry. Uh, mm -hmm. And then, along with that, Landorus... Uh, actually, can I even do any moves right now? No moves? No at will moves? Ba -ba -ba -ba. Uh, let's see. Yeah, actually, you know what? I'm gonna do this. Landorus is going to take off to the sky. Hey, yo, where bro going? Uh huh. He's Did going. Did Landorus just use fly? Perhaps. Uh, Roosevelt, you're up. Uh, sure. you just see as uh, as Landorus just takes off into the sky. Make a perception check to see if you can detect where they are. <laughs> because it is sure. currently it is it's naturally very cloudy already, but the Ooh, let's see. Not bad. So the sand, 14. the there is also a uh, harsh sandstorm going around, so it is clouding your vision. You're able to get a like very faint, um, like uh, what was it? A very faint uh, silhouette of where Landers could be. However, you realize it is. 25 meters up in the air. As a rough Probably. estimate. Oh. 25 meters? Yep. Huh. Okay. Hey, do I you fly think up you six. Can... Oh? Wait, what, what was that? I fly up towards him six meters. Oh, okay. I have six meters of sky speed. Gotcha. Do you think you could possibly nasty plot as well? I, th I thought oh, you said... I, I have a plan. Okay. Anyways, okay. so... So now do I know that he's clearly there? Uh, yeah. I'll say I'll say that you could like the like you caught a very uh, faint silhouette, but now mm. as you get closer up in the air, you're able to see it a bit more. Great, love Oya, Aura. He's infatuated. Uh, and uh, nasty plot. That's a. Uh, let's see here. Uh, That's a plus two bonus now. That is Special a plus that we two. both have because yeah, well, of. We, uh, Oh, I actually have that show up. Uh, and a special mm -hmm. attack. Let me raise this by two. And Fantastic. I believe I also get it because it's symbiotic. Yep. So infatuation, I'm sure you know what it means, but let me read it at, you know, for, you, the, yeah. for the uh, viewers at home. Infatuated tar users. Users. <gasps> I'm sure that I, I'm, not, I'm sure that's a typo, but <laughs> people who are infatuated take a minus five penalty on all damage rolls that do not include their crush as the target. Can you for determining uh, damage rolls that do not include their trust uh, their crush as a target, the infatuated target's attack and special attack are halved. The Ooh. user is cured of infatuation with a save check of 16 plus made at the end of the turn. Ooh. Okay. Can you uh basically just uh like click copy on the page. love aura thing? Like don't copy. Actually, no, no, no. I I, oh. I I got you. I got you. I got it. You could just you be able to roll it. it. Yeah. I got. Yeah. It. I can just uh. Boop. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Boop. That way there we go. is the okay. May inflict one per round as as a free action. Free action, one per round. No range cap. 
Uh, ah. So he's 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 cooked, uh, and uh, if he hits me, he's gonna have to uh, make a roll, cue, you know, keyword recoil, this and that. And I'm also six meters into the air, or sorry, well, yeah, it, yeah, six meters only, into the air. It's only so, recoil if it's a five or lower. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay, indeed it is. And I'm six feet in the air, which means that it's going to be. <clears throat> It's difficult for him to hit me as well as you guys. Okay. Let me just make a quick little. I have I have a slight suspicion that 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 this guy is probably gonna fly down on someone. It's what the move does. So, yeah. Like probably either Alta or Hydrapple or or me, Irene. also a flying weak Pokemon. It might not know that Irene's immune though. Might not know. I mean, it might know the Marshadow is a fighting type. So, oh, shit. Or Marshadow. That's right. Mm hmm. Let me also copy and paste infatuation to the chat. Okay. Please do. Minus five on all damage rolls. For all, on, uh, on all damage yeah. rolls. So, does that mean, like, accuracy rolls or, like, oh, I... hey, look, Psychic does 3d10 plus 10 damage? That's 3d10 minus. Let's see, one for each roll, so minus 15 plus 10. Let me see, for determining damage rolls that do include the infatuated, I think... It does say damage rolls, and yeah. other things do say accuracy. So I think... I th yeah, I think this minus is, this five is to damage, damage rolls. rolls. Yeah, so... Okay, yeah, and then... Basically, normally it's like, oh yeah, they have a minus five on all... on all... any damage dealt. But if it's they're attacking their crush, it's even worse. It's basically as if their target or special or their attacker special attack are halved. The user is cute. Okay, all right. So Landorus is going to from the top ropes, um, because it's they, Landorus from the top ropes with a stale chair. Because they're very angry at Auta earlier, are gonna try and aim it at them. As I still don't know why they're still angry at me, man. You literally just wanted to leave. Hmm. Don't you don't care? All right. Who? Okay. So that it. Did the music stop already. Jeez. Oh, okay. No, it's just Bongo being weird. All right. So Bongo sixty-five. Moment. Just subtract that, and then Outa, you are taking ninety physical damage. Damn. Perfect pair. Ooh. Ah. Uh, unfortunate. Damn. All right, and now let's make a chat. Okay. Oh, Royal Guard. <gasps> Landorus is unfortunately still um, infatuated. Mm -hmm. Uh uh uh. Okay, that was that, and then now for their next two turns. Well, it doesn't rob Landorus of any turn. Nope. Like nope. The only the only um, <laughs> afflictions that can. Uh, that affect the action economy, uh, the, or like they can, yeah, are paralysis and sleep. Okay. Alright, in that case, for this turn, Landers is going to use Regenerator. By taking a breath, taking a breather, he's going to recover one third of their max hit points. Oh. Don't steal my shtick. Oh, hush now. You well, have you aren't here to do your shtick. And also, you haven't even used it at all. And now we're going to roll again. Generator before? Oh my god. This is really Ryan Pookie's stick oh in SPML. Okay, uh, and then... No smoking. Landorus is going to... This is the only thing he can do. Gonna do it again! He's gonna fly up. Mm -hmm. Oh, How and is no longer infatuated. Let's go! All How right. elaborate do we have to make this fight? Get down here! Hey, you s hey, it lavend lavender didn't suppress him. You wouldn't have to spam fly. Anyways, Hydrapple, you're up. Wait, oh. why is Landorus's why is because Lavender's he's... speed forty? Uh, because Irene used Tailwind. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's why Alta actually has more than one speed. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's wonderful, isn't it? Okay, so my idea, like, with. Ooh, wait a minute. Question If I use Draco Meteor, will it kind of 
it, it is. Uh, unfortunately, no. 25 no. meters in the air. Yeah. Won't be able to hit. Nope. No, this isn't like Literally. like that one battle in the anime. <laughs> Literally, nothing I have will, like, hit it. I Do a status it. move. Yippee. Nasty um, grapple. No, but I do. <laughs> Get down here. How are we doing? That's uh, I can scream that in game. How are we doing? The map is fine. Get down here! I can use dragon spear for time being for um. Outside. Oh yeah, yeah, you can. <laughs> what does dragon spear do? Dragon spear! Ra! Any user affected by this blessing may activate it when making a successful attack to turn the attack into a critical hit. Oh. Uh huh. Can we let me use that on an ice punch? All right. Um. Now, like uh, Outa, punch. you have a speed tie now with Landorus. Heads or tails? Ooh. Can I, can I uh, choose to uh, just fail it automatically? Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. I want it. get down here, bro. Spe uh, bro, spending his time trying to outspeed him by yapping. All right. In that case, that oh, oh god! Oh, oh, you're kidding! Maybe have Irene jump in the way. <laughs> she already used her turn. She already used her 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 her, her turn this this round. So yeah, if this KOs me, if this KOs me, I'm just leaving the session. I'll let you know that heads up. Oh my god. There's no way that this can so do silly. that. That is uh 134 physical damage. That is so funny, but oh my god. Oh, oh no, man. he crits human shield, human shield. <laughs> well, the human shield would be immune to it. Yeah, what? but but what? here, but n n yes, no, Irene. They have wind yeah. Bail. However, uh, interception is a full action. Irene used all of her actions this round. Okay. All right, uh, so how much damage does Alto take? That is 134 physical. 134 physical. <laughs> Lander is still acting four times. Ah. This is what happens when you flinch him. Uh, but, uh, what was you I just... wanted to do that, Jacob. Uh, you yeah, y'all did use the action economy to give Bestie, like, three turns in a row. Mm. I used it to paralyze it, because I thought we would do... It wouldn't that would be also give turns. it, like, three turns in a row. Mm. In a row. Well, so, also you know, gets another injury as he's... As Leather Stereans proceeds to just... Just, uh, just fly <laughs> up and then just... Yeah. Just dive right on top of him from the top row. No, actually, no, no, no. Lander's literally just like sits on him. <laughs> Dang. All right. Oh, uh, no, I am not letting you get away with that. Otto says it's me being crushed. I mean, hey, well, you wanted, good. you wanted to. Uh, what was I gonna say? Um, Dragon cheer, uh, exhaust oh Draco meteor. Oh god. Okay, here we go. I am not. This is. I'm mad. I'm mad, mad. Oh, he angry. He very angry. All right. It hit. Well, yeah, it's a crate. Of course, it's gonna hit. And it is one step more effective because it's exhaust. All right. Jesus. All right. That's it. Now that's a lot of damage. That is. Oh I, God. You I, dealt I'll more tell you this. damage. I'll tell you just dealt for a while. underneath it. I'm going to give you one chance to get from me as a giant Draco meteor slams down on top of Landry's <laughs> gear. Well, that's 129. I am super effective. All right. That, <clears throat> now that's a, again, that's a lot of damage. All right. Landorus just like stiff, like the like picks themselves back up, and uh, let's see. Uh, I'm still so uh, I'm still suppressed. So yep. we're going to. Do it again. Uh, uh, there, you're gonna fly do it again. again and go back. To, oh yeah. my god. Bestie, you chose this outcome. And yeah, then... but since he's coming back down on Alta with that last turn in the initiative. So he uh, should still be here. Is Alta just like struggles to stand back up? Whoa! Yeah, accidentally. Yeah, yeah, the map accidentally shifted a bit. My bad. Alright, and then for the next one. Oh. Shadow Landorus is going to um Wait. wait. Wait, What's what? Up? What? No, 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 no! It, we had two turns. Yeah, yeah. First turn was to start flying. Second turn was to come back down. Yeah, this is the second turn. 
Okay. Bestie, you're slowing. All, all the slows, I've made it give yeah. one more billion turns in a row. Yeah, because here's the thing. This one with the six was the one that he used for the second turn of fly on Outa that got a crit. These last okay. two ones that have a one were both used for fly. Got it. On Marshadow. Goes mm -hmm. up and then comes back down on Marshadow. Yep, so that uh, Marshadow... coming back down on the second one. Yes. What if I click the silly button? Uh, ooh, as an in... Wait, but you're oh, this beginning of their next beginning of their next turn. You already use your mm -hmm. turn this round, remember? Ah, uh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, if if um, this if this was reaction, then you could do that, but this is standard action. So uh, that okay, is. I do have reactions though. Yeah. Wait a second, I have several. Ooh. Which one do I want to click? Oh, worm. Mmm. No, I've interrupts, not reactions. Yeah. It's sad. Yes, yeah, so I have I have reactions on the silly uh, uh robot. Yeah, on the <laughs> all right, and that is <laughs> oh my god. So I have a friend that's watching the stream, and the and they just messaged me <laughs> how uh the 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 crit that uh Lander has got against how to hurt their soul. Uh, anyways, but yeah, that is no, I got him back. I got him back. So true, so true. But yeah, that is 93 uh, physical damage on Marshadow. All right, get it, yippee. All right, top of the round. Uh, it is Lavender's turn now. All right. We're gonna dupe, dupe, dupe. We got, we got Dragon Cheer up, so if you yep. want to crit Ice Beam, please yep. do. And also... Uh, no, I wasn't targeted for that. No, 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 no. This, it, it's a blessing. It's like light screen. It applies to everyone. Yeah, and on top of that, oh. we, still have, we can still use it two times. And it says the first time uh, a scene, a dragon type activates a blessing, it doesn't count towards its limit. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, and I can use it on an ice punch. Case, just in case I don't get to do, like, somehow I miss or something, I'm just going to do this. You you can't Suppressed miss again. an auto crit with... Yeah, but still. Bro, are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, time to talk. You gave Mewtwo two suppressing things. That and was so I didn't do that. I didn't do that. One. PTU did. Okay, yeah. so I'll use Ice Beam and I'll use the um Dragon whatever the cheer. heck it is. Dragon make... Cheer, Dragon Cheer, Dragon Cheer to make a crit. Sure. All right, and Jacob uh... when he learns uh, what King Gutter can do in doubles with Dragon All Cheer. All right, so that's going to be a crit. So I need to add an additional two D ten plus ten, or yeah. just two D ten. Two D ten. Okay. You also did raise your special attack by two combat stages, right? Oh, yeah, I did. I did. Okay, thank goodness. Okay. So that is going to be 79 mm -hmm. multiplied by 2. Yep. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -da. And also, if we're damage. allowing this to be crits as in, like, it got a net 20, uh -huh. it's also frostbit. Uh, that's no, not we're, not, we're not allowing that. It's a critical hit. It's a critical hit in that sense, not in the accuracy sense. Got it. Okay. Yeah. It's an automatic crit, not an automatic nat 20. There's a difference. All right, Irene, you're up. Right, also, Irene. No, let's, let, let's save that other dragon chair. I got nice punch ready. Uh, also, POV, uh, uh, Lavender just made uh, Landorus suppress. Now he's going to keep spamming fly against Out and Marshadow gonna lose it <laughs> down soon don't worry no i'm gonna go down soon you get a turn before it all right if it uh, dies here we're good if it doesn't we're we're, we're mega screwed anyway you go right before it why are you complaining because it also moves three times after me but you'll kill do i do we don't know its health jacob jacob we don't know its health at all we don't no, no. That's, oh, that's Marshadow's health. The health bar's been redacted. Oh. Jacob, yeah. we don't know. Who is Jacob, oh try to pay attention challenge. Impossible. Impossible. <laughs> Jacob, I don't know if this kills or not. He's seeing the health bar. He's doing his best. <laughs> true, that is. Yeah. The DM specifically said the health bar was being redacted. Yep. Oh, then the DM said that when I was doing my laundry. 
That was that was before the laundry. Yeah. That was I, during I, your turn. I yeah, uh, I said that. That was during that. your turn. <laughs> I said it at the we, very start of. We all, you know, don't <laughs> well, Okay. This, this, this oh, yeah. Let's just move forward. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Let's yeah. just yeah. click silly it's moves. Rejected. We're 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 Let's here. We're just here what for does the. Irene do? Yeah, we're just here for the funny uh, tabletop Pokemon game. Okay. All right. Let's see what does Irene do? Uh, Irene's going to prankster free action grassy terrain. Oh, you can only wait. Hold on. Yeah, you can only prankster once per yeah. battle. Wait, per really? Per scene. I, I said that. I also said that. It's a scene. I also said, remember, thing. prankster is scene one. Uh. Oh yeah, scene swift. Okay, yeah, I didn't see the scene part. Mm -hmm. Yep. My bad. In that case, uh, redact grassy terrain. Let's see. Mm -hmm. That case, uh, wait, who has an ice type move lined up next time around? I do. Yippee. Uh, who are you? You're playing Marshadow, right? Yep. All right, so Irene's going to move around a bit. That's just within range, perfect. And is going to uh, helping hand Marshadow. Yippee! 